Mr. Speaker, I rise in opposition to H.R. 3, which has nothing to do with taxpayer funding of abortion. Right or wrong, federal funding for abortion hasn't been allowed for more than three decades. Instead, H.R. 3 has everything to do with infringing on the constitutionally protected right to an abortion that has been the law of the land for 38 years. For years, we've been listening to Republicans call for smaller government, less regulation, fewer taxes. But this bill represents the opposite of these values. It's more regulation on business, more regulation on health care decisions that should be left up to women and their doctors. It's more taxes on small business, more taxes on women, and it's more control by anti-choice extremists in Washington. Finally, this bill isn't about job creation either. Instead, it's about bringing up divisive legislation that has no hope of becoming law in order to divide and distract the American people. It's been four months and still the new majority here hasn't brought a serious bill about job creation to this floor for a vote. It's time to get back to the work of putting Americans back to work. Let's do that. I yield back.